hello students we will do detection of anions right and the first video we detected carbonate sulfite and sulfate that experiment we have seen and now we will see the other three anions that is chloride nitrate and sulfide right so for this i have taken all these three salts in the test tube right here we have sodium chloride for chloride de detection we have nitrate for no3 minus nitrate detection and we have here ferrous sulfide for s2 minus detection right so first i am taking here chloride and we will be using here test tube holder for this right and let us add now these three will be detected by concentrated sulfuric acid use of first three were detected by dilute sulfuric acid now this is second part is detected by the other three by concentrated sulfuric acid now you will see that fumes started coming out from the test tube see these are hcl gas fumes in moist air right so now how to confirm that the gas is hcl i am bringing rod dipped in ammonium hydroxide we will see dense white fumes of ammonium hydroxide are coming out from the test tube see these are very dense fumes right so this is dense fumes are actually tiny solid particles of ammonium chloride and this confirms that the gas is hcl and the salt present in this is salt has chloride as anion so chloride anion we detected now the second one we are taking is sodium nitrate and for sodium nitrate you we have to add concentrated sulfuric acid and then heat it so when we will add concentrated sulfuric acid and heat it then we will see some brown fumes coming out from the test tube look at this right and we will bring here filter paper dipped in ki solution so potassium iodide solution turns brown ki paper turns brown you can bring ki paper also so you will see after some time here reddish brown fumes will start coming out it will take little time but you will see here reddish brown fumes will start coming out see slowly you will see here and you can see here ki paper has turned brown in the center look at this nicely we can see over here ki paper is turning brown see beautiful it is here and here reddish brown fumes will start coming out you can see slight reddish brown fumes and these reddish brown fumes are actually nitrogen dioxide gas and this nitric acid which is formed will further decompose into nitrogen dioxide and this nitrogen dioxide the test is confirmatory test is uh, ki paper turns brown so this is confirmed that the anion is nitrate no3 one minus nitrate right now the next one which we are doing is sulfide detection of s2 minus for that i have taken here ferrous sulfide okay pieces now we will be adding here concentrated sulfuric acid and we will heat it right little heating is required and we will see a gas liberates which has a rotten egg smell here i am heating it and it will it has rotten egg smell and which will turn lead acetate paper silvery black this is lead acetate paper which i have taken and we will put it on this we will see it will turn silvery black and here we have this hydrogen sulfide gas coming out and lead acetate paper will turn silvery black it has started turning silvery black see my hands were of potassium uh, iodide so you can see little blue color as also here uh, yellow color is also there here you can see that is a shiny black color okay little more we will heat
lead acetate paper will turn you know silvery black see we can see immediately see it has turned completely see this is called silvery black right so the gas which is coming out has a rotten egg smell and it is turning silvery black and this confirms that the salt has sulfide as anion s2 minus so these are the other three anions chloride nitrate and sulfide weighted thank you students